best for soil, compost, thermophilic compost. Hello. Hi, my name is Alfred Grand. The Best for Soil video provides an introduction to thermophilic compost production and application. At the end of the video, you will find additional information on these topics. Please also watch the other Best for Soil videos on compost and other soil health related topics. Composted organic matter, or COM, is a product produced from the microbial decomposition of organic matter under aerobic conditions. Depending on composting method, size, intensity of the operation and the input feedstock, a large range of composts with different qualities can be produced. Thermophilic compost, also called hot rotting compost, is the most common compost product produced. It can be produced at different scales, from small heaps with manual turning up to tractor-driven or even self-propelled industrial-scale composting methods. Thermophilic compost should reach temperatures of 60 degrees Celsius to 65 degrees Celsius for several days throughout the heap. This temperature helps to kill and deactivate weed seeds and pathogens in the compost. Compost production is underlying different regulations in each EU member state. Even these regulations differ depending on size of operation, used resources and the risk of contamination through compost production, for example, for the surface and groundwater body. The perfect location to site your compost production area depends on a wide range of characteristics. Aside from following local and state regulations, the principal decision to be made is to either compost on a sealed surface where you can control and collect your runoffs and where you can work in wet conditions or to directly compost on the soil surface. You should be aware of accessibility and transport costs but also emissions from the compost heap such as smell, dust and contaminations and their potential impact of the surrounding environment. The availability of feedstock resources in your area is critical if you want to produce your own compost. The most important characteristic to consider is the carbon to nitrogen ratio of your starting feedstock. Manures often work for themselves, especially if they include carbon-dominated bedding material. With other resources, starting blends have to be made. All organisms need a range of environmental conditions to thrive. This is also true for the microbes which produce the thermophilic compost. The availability of oxygen in the composting heap and a moisture content of 60 to 80% is critical. To keep the process running, it is necessary to have enough physical structure in the heap to allow oxygen to be present, but also turning the heaps frequently is necessary nearly for every operation. At this time, corrections can be made for the water content by irrigating, but also for altering the carbon-nitrogen ratio, at least at the beginning of the process. Depending on the size of the operation, more or less technology is necessary for producing high-quality composts. At the agricultural scale, a large front-end loader to build and turn the heap is required, but also to load the material through a sieve. For application, a compost spreader is also necessary. To turn the compost heap, a 3-metre-wide tractor-driven compost turner is often used. Turning compost heaps is a slow process. Therefore, the best option is either the tractor offers a speed range of 200 to 400 meter per hour, or the turner has to have its own hydraulic driven powertrain and the ability to push the tractor in neutral gear. Most composting technology can be easily shared by multiple farmers, rented, or the work can be done by contractors. Beside focusing on optimizing the production of the material, it is also important to monitor the quality of the material produced. We have prepared a Best for Soil video on this topic also. It is critical to inform yourself on the local and state regulations with regards to compost application. 
These rules may insist on certain quality parameter, but also on when application can occur and the amount of compost which is allowed to be spread on the field or in a greenhouse. Depending on the size of the operation, often the application of compost can be outsourced. Professional contractors do not only have the right technology like tyre pressure adjustment systems, but also often can help with the documentation of the compost application. Compost production is a process which needs a lot of know-how and some experience. If you want to get more information on compost, feel free to check the Best for Soil website where you can find additional resources.